my name is uh, Mahduma Nargis. By profession, I'm a physician. I took part in the uh, Liberation War of Bangladesh as a uh, physician, and I worked in the uh, in all the many camps of Agartala because uh, all the nine months I was in Agartala, and I served there as a doctor, medical practitioner. And you see, there are many stories to say about. Uh, to say about our liberation war. I want to recall one or two incidences uh, that is uh, still in my mind and still I remember with pride. Uh, one is, you see, when I was serving in the, um, as a, in the camp as a doctor, I, I had to see the patients and also the wounded patients and also to see the young men who came from Bangladeshi region for uh, to join the liberation war as a freedom fighter, I have to check their physical fitness. And then, uh, when I one day when I was in the in my medical center, I was working. Two, uh, you see, young um, men came. They were about uh, 15 or 16 years of age and not very healthy. And they said me they I should uh, give them a certificate that they are 18 years old and they want to join as if uh, in the freedom fighter and, uh, and they want to take the training, uh, the military training. And I said that, you see, uh, I cannot give you a false certificate. But they said that, you see, we are coming from a Kapashia. At the then, it was a part of a rural uh, Dhaka Jila, uh, Dhaka district. And you see, they, they, um, there were uh, the Pakistani armies invaded those areas and killed many people, raped many uh, women. Uh, even uh, girl giants also, and they they also ransacked the whole region. So they uh, promised, seeing all these atrocities, that they should kill at least one or two Pakistani army uh, before they die. And they, that's why they want to go to the battlefield and fight so that uh, uh, they can get some uh, revenge, they can get some revenge, take some revenge to those people, those Pakistanis, and uh, they have ransacked their villages. And uh, this is one, and the another one, I was, I said with my uh, greatest pride, that when I used to serve the wounded uh, people coming from Bangladesh area after, uh, uh, they were wounded by the Pakistani people also and also when they took part in the operation and are injured. I used to dress their wounds and uh, etc. And I saw those uh, uh, fighters, freedom fighters, that they were so determined, so uh, devoted to their cause. They don't say, ah, or oof, when I used to dress them. Because they were, uh, they, they tolerated all the pain uh, and it, it, they thought that it is their um, great chance that they are serving their country.